Call me the Oppenheimer of Skipjack, because I'm nuking him. That was a blow up. He's, He's on it. Oh, buddy. <laughs> Watch out for them treble hooks. That was cold. <laughs> Deep, too. All right, you gonna keep him or release him? I'll release him. He deserves the lift. He deserves it. He's probably traumatized more than I am. He's like, why is this guy swimming down here to get <laughs> Like, I'm just gonna hide under this lock. Very nice. Let him go for a minute. Seth and I were getting hangry at each other there. <laughs> Shut up. No, come on. <laughs> Don't grab the pole. He's not going to remember to grab the pole, not to grab the pole, because he's in the water dying trying to get this fish. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's like, that was an unintentional swim. How cold is it? 58? 58. Freezing balls. That's what it said on the, uh, the, the depth finder. Freezing balls, yeah. <laughs> it's just the logo of some like nuts with ice on them. <laughs> like, yeah, I'll jump in. Okay, you guys, so I totally forgot to film an intro yesterday, which is going to be for the video you're watching right now. Um, so my buddy Jeff and I, he's a dentist in Nashville, we are going striper fishing to wear out some striped bass here in Tennessee. And uh, you are in store for a no B-roll, at least the first portion of it, because this is two days worth of videos. I'm still tired, obviously. Um, straight up. Big striper smackdown craziness, and hopefully, we'll have that today. You guys ready to catch some fish? Let's go. That's on. Fish on. Fish on. Got him? Yeah, baby. Maybe coming at you. Got him? There yeah. he is. There he is. He's fighting weird. Where's he at? He's right behind us. Odd. He ain't taking off yet. There he goes. He's starting to. We got a little drag. He's, he's doing a little detour now. There we go. There's some. I don't know how good he's hooked. That one came out from the center. There we go. Oh, there we go. That's what we want. Some drag a pull in. Good yeah, morning. Baby. Yeah, baby. Doc ain't awake yet. He will be here in a second. <laughs> we ain't done introductions yet, so this is going to be our introduction with a big old striper. Good morning, world. We're here on the Yangtze River in eastern Vietnam, <laughs> catching the illustrious cool water striped bass because they have cold water in Vietnam. Yes, sir. Fresh water. Yeah. We may need to put some heat on it so he doesn't get in these other ones. Yeah, he's taking you on the beach we are out there. There we go. I'm going to let these guys out. He wasn't even really where we wanted to. We did one pass earlier, you guys, before I had the camera out or anything. I think he's in it. Yeah, he's in it. That's all right. There's part of this. We don't have a net this time either, again. But we do have a striper. How big he is? I don't know yet. He's kind of dogging you. Yeah, I think he's uh, a little teenager. Yeah. Those big ones usually come up to the top and go freaking nuts. He took that quietly, didn't he? He did. He like hit it and came at us. Oh, our bait tank's overflowing. Oh, shit. Here. I got it. I'm going to turn it around. We're just washing out the boat, you guys. Double? Uh-oh. Is this pumping water out? Nope. Well, we're going to flood the boat here for a little while. Pretty fish. Oh, this one's about to get hit. You may be on your own. Yeah, this one's on. This one's on. Where's he at? Oh, what happened? What happened? Did he just cut me off on something? Oh, he came at me. Yeah, 
I just messed that one up. Dang it. Oh yeah. Yep. I messed that fish up. Yeah. We're overflowing here a little bit. Yeah. The grip is caught on the back. We're gonna pump this out. We got a mess going. You guys. We'll be right back. Fish, fish. <laughs> got him. Hell yeah. Yeah, put that one in there. Jeff's got one in the tank. I got one on right here. Yes, sir. Come here. I don't know how good of a hook I've got in this one. I hope she just swallowed it to her butthole. There's some drag. Oh, this one's coming up to the surface. That bubbler went off. You're gonna have to fix that one. Oh, buddy, here we go. Good morning. We're actually in Tennessee, you guys. We're not in Vietnam. But we got a big striper in the tank. And I got me a good one on the line right here. Yes, sir. And we don't have a net. I'm convinced that if I come over prepared for a fishing trip, nothing crazy happens. But when you're underprepared, that's when it happens. Let's go. My board has not popped. It's wrapped. This is. Come on. That one on the far right's getting chased. Jeff? Yep. All right, so what we need to do. Um, let's take this out and let's let's try to get that out of our way if we can because we may may be about to have a triple here so we would have had a triple if i didn't mess this fish up but he swam at me at mock jesus and i just didn't get him all right i am going to require assistance right here okay. see how that thing's screwed up Oh God, it's wrapped bad. This fish may get off. I guess just kind of try to hold it tight for me. Where's it going? Up front? Shoot, this is messed up. This is not good. Let me know if he's going up towards that. Okay, I got it off. Yeah. I turned the troll motor off because I don't know where that fish is at. Okay, we got her. That was crazy. That happened, we were tuna fishing too. I lost my board. Oh, another good fish. Look at that. Look at that. That's another 20 plus big dog. Oh, yeah. Um,. All right, she's, she's on a stinger. We're gonna, I'm gonna bring her to the left, okay? Sure. Man, this is a mess. Oh, that's a good one. Get up here. Open up. That's a horse. Shit. Oh. You got her? Shit. She used to be all hooked. We'll figure it out. Wow. Okay. All right, guys. Well, there's two. Hold on. We got we to gotta compose ourselves Ooh. here. Let's go. All right. So we're letting those striper recuperate in the tank for a second, and we're hooking hooking baits back up because it's this is the money time and you just gotta get baits back in the water and those striper down the tank they'll be 
pissed off and ready to go once you get them out. It's a good way to revive them. Gosh, this guy's tough. All right, got him. So we're, we're getting our biggest baits and we're just getting them back out. We are in what we call the, the witching hour here. This is right after daybreak. We got fresh skipjack we caught and we're pulling them next to a deep bank with some current on it. I mean, we're just throwing the biggest and meanest, liveliest baits we can get and they're getting munched. We're in some clearest water right here, so we're having to let the baits go down a little bit deeper. So I'm putting about, I don't know, 15, 20 feet back behind the board. And uh, that's getting our baits munched. Pretty good. I gotta get, oh, that board's up there that I need. I mean, they're chilling. See, they're mean. Once, once we put them back in the water, they're just gonna bolt off. And I just turned that on Jackrabbit. Let's turn that off Jackrabbit. Okay. And we're just running four baits, you guys. We're just trying to be as accurate as we can right now. I'm not running floats or down mines or anything like that. Just four boards, and I'm putting them right on where, where we think the fish are going to be at. There's no current on the main river, and we've got a little smaller river that's dumping current out into the river, and we're fishing that area where that current from the little river hits. And then that's where they're at. Goes that way. No? Oh, yeah, put that one on that side. Yeah. Oh, I guess I, oh, I need that board, I guess. Yeah. I mean, we almost had a triple. Like, that would have been nuts. Every bait we had out got hit. Yeah. Every single one. Well, except, except the little guy who had the leaf on it. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's true. It's time to shine. Call me the Oppenheimer of Skipjack, because I'm nuking them. We got our baits back out. Let's, uh, let's, let's look at some fish here in a second. Here we go, baby. Fish numero uno. Upper 20, close 30 pounder. Put them back. Monster, bro. Go enjoy. She gone. There's my big girl, baby. Number two, we probably close to 60 pounds for the morning on striper. Not bad. Fins are sticking up. She's good to go. We're going to release her. Nice, cool water. She gone. Yeah. Let's go. One of these got hit in, while we were trying to do stuff, so we're going to try to reset here and get back at it. Yeah, this guy. This guy got bonked pretty good, you guys. While we were trying to do that release. I'm surprised he's still alive. Yeah, look, you can kind of see where they hit him. A little bit of scales missing. He'll be fine. I don't know how it didn't hook up. It must have just bit his tail. That back yeah, it's just sticking in the side of them. It'll be fine. Sometimes I just let it sit there. Yeah. Just hang out.
Yeah, they both swam down. They would have come back up, but now they were going to die. I can actually bait that. Get these baits to go over there, right? Those are really good quality fish. I think they were both 30. Got a blue herring. No way. Look at this. Blue herring has our daggum skipjack. He took it. Yeah, that blue heron literally stole our bait. What? Oh. Fish on, fish on. Real, 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 real. Set it. Got him. Got him. Real, 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 real. There we go. Real, real. He's coming at you, coming at you. I bet he chased those daggum. Uh, uh, gizzard chat out that just came by the boat. Fish on, baby. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, baby. Got him. That's tight. You got a really good one. Um, if you'll step down to the left. All right, we're hooked up again, y'all. It's the third fish in the morning. We've missed four others probably. Go ahead and move your foot here. Want to get this bait over there out of your way or at least try to i'm gonna have to speed this up he's pulling us backwards just get him out of that tree yeah put some put some muscle on him you got you got to tighten the drag down do it he's pulling trying to pull us into a tree you guys and that drag was tight All right, I'm gonna pull it. Go. I'm, gonna, I'm pulling us in the channel. We're, we're good. He's going this way. I was trying to double us up again, but we just need to get him out. Dude, he smacked the crap he out did. of it. What's he feel like? Yeah. The he horse feels, feels healthy. He's a healthy type. Smoke on the water. Big stripers killing our baits. Herring's eating our baits. It's a pretty cool morning here in Vietnam. All right, let's slow us back down now. I got this guy out of the danger zone. I'm gonna, I guess I'm gonna have to crank the drag down a little bit. He almost took us in. Right, he almost took me in right there. I think he may have a pretty decent one. I'm gonna close this tank up. And then let me get those grips right here. A baby. A baby? Yep. Is he worthy of the grips? I don't know that I want to. Oh, yeah, he's a baby. Oh, man, he almost got me. That's a fun sizer for sure. There we go. About 13 pounds, something like that. That's a beautiful fish. Yeah. Let me get you a picture real quick. Another solid fish for the morning. Go ahead and chuck them back. Be gone. Number three, Thanks, number three. On them, baby. 
we're getting chased right here. We finally got all our baits out. Had some homies that decided to drag right on top of this and almost ginger age, but I did not. You proud of me? I am proud of you. It was, I mean, you saw the it was right there. When you saw the flag on this planer board, you knew it. You couldn't. I couldn't be that guy. Yeah, they, 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 they can't help themselves. They're doing the best they can. You want this one on the inside? Yeah. Fish. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I'm hooked up. This is a good one. My phone's bad. My GoPro's gonna die. Hooked up, baby! Another. We're hooked up. My GoPro uh, died, or the battery just got ripped out of my pants. So uh, we got the hookup on camera, and we just got hit by the main flow, and my trolling motor was going like a six and a half and we were only going 0.2 miles an hour upstream so we're gonna have to start working down now or we're gonna nuke nuke our trolling motor batteries but this dude obliterated one of the biggest jacks we had i mean he just destroyed it i think i got most of the, the hellacious run but right now while i've got this guy hooked up i'm doing what's called slipping back so i'm taking this planer board right there I'm using the current and the resistance of the, the current against the board to pull that board over there as I'm coming back while I'm fighting this fish so that we can maybe hook another one. Get another double. Give it a little bit more line. Oh, he may be in something. I think he just took me in a tree down there. Dang it. He got me in a tree. Hmm. We're gonna have to go over here and try to get him out. Well, I got him out, you guys. Oh, yeah. big girl. Yep. <laughs> got her out. She was in a tree way down here. I stuck my rod in the water and just kind of, nope, nope, nope. You're not going anywhere. That's all you get. Got her hooked on the bottom. That's why I couldn't turn her. And in this side. Okay. Uh, I guess let me have the drift. Nope, nope. Okay. Figure out how to do this. Can we hold the rod? Yeah. Oh, big girl. Big girl. She's got one hook in her mouth. It's rebel, but the, the big hook, the finger, the main's on the, on the bottom of it. Oh, she broke the treble off. She broke the treble off. Look. Oh, wow. Oh, got her. Let me put girl. her in here for a second. Big girl. That was wild. So here's this big girl, another one, 30 plus. Beautiful. Big girl, we just got obliterated on one of the rods to the right and it pulled off while we were getting this girl situated. But we're gonna release her. That one's over 30 for sure. That one's probably mid 30s, I'd say. Now she's ready to go. Ow, ow! Get out of here. Get the crap out of me. All right. Bait's back in the water, baby. Let's go. Let's go. We got a bait getting chased right now. It's Mr. Jeff's turn here to catch him a big old striped bass. We're gonna crack 40 at some point here today. My parole officer does it on here. Don't use my first name. I got us way too close to that tree, so we're gonna have to reel in. Will he eat it in my hand, or will he not? 
Come on, baby. Eat biscuit, Jack. Get him. Oh, he came off. Dang it. Huh. Well, there's one right there. I told you there'd be one right at the tip of that island. Wow, man. The bait's still alive. Yeah, I think the tracer hooks, treble hooks are clutch. They are. This other one's getting nervous. Yep. Sit right yonder for a minute. That bait has seen better days. Oh, somehow he hit it and turned it around to where a scale was on the tip of the hook for a second. Look at him. That was all the way in his mouth, dude. Look, yeah. no scales. Darn. Well, we're not going to feed him right now. Bait, sir. Thank you. I'm gonna let you just chuck him over there and hold it. Okay. Let me get those rods out of your way up there. Take that off for a second. Mm -hmm. Watch out for that drone and shit behind you. I hope to God that dries out. lob type technique Fish. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. I'm hooked up. This is a good one. My phone's bad. My GoPro's gonna die. Hooked up, baby! <laughs> Double number dose of the morning. Two or two doubles. Two or three doubles. These are over 20 pound fish. Very nice. Yours is definitely bigger. She said. Hey, not to me. There's there's a big giant double again. All right, let's release him. Drop them both back. They're gonna be ready to roll. See ya. Hit him in the head and he'll go. We don't know he's free yet. There he goes. See ya. Very nice, bro. Very nice. Sometimes I gotta get their bearings. Heck yeah. There she goes. Yep. Let's go, baby. We up to six big old strappers this morning. We pretty much out of bait, too. And we probably lost six others. Hitting all weird. Let's go. Well, you worn out yet? That wore me out. <laughs> That's a good morning already. We're at, it's 10 o'clock, too. That ain't bad. Six monster stripers by 10. It's not too bad. Well, he's getting his baited back up, and I gotta use the bucket. <laughs> that time of the morning. Fish on, fish on, fish on. Oh, God, that's going. Another one. Oh, my God. I can't get out of the holder. I can't get out of the holder. Oh my God. 
It's about to break the rod. Dude. This is a horse. Oh, yeah. oh he just came off. No way. Oh. Okay, no, he's on. He's acting real screwy, though. Something weird just happened there. Oh, he's way out there. Dude, what the heck? I think the board fine. What? Yeah, I guess. Why not? Dude, I think this is a big one. He's staying at the top, and those big girls do that. We are having an incredible morning. Holy crap. This one to the left's getting chased. Yeah, I saw the fish come up underneath it. We're just getting baits in the water as quick as we can. Nothing else we can do. Yeah, he's getting circled on back there. Yeah. Oh, we're in eight feet of water. God, I hope we don't run into a stump field out here. I've never fished this section right here. Yeah, or no, I uh, let it out. Yeah, let it out. He's gonna, all right, let me bring the rod up. Okay. Ah, right, he's in it. He's in it. Maybe not. I don't know. I don't think he is. Oh, well. How deep are we? Eight feet? And there's stumps and stuff all underneath us. God, this guy needs to come up. Here, hold this for a second. You sure? Yeah. Like this. All right. Thanks, sir. Mm -hmm. I'll take my fish back. I thought he came off, dude. Something weird happened. Yeah, he snagged. We're going to back the drag off now that we're close to the boat. I don't know how big this fish is. Oh, that's a mess. I'll have to come down there. It is what it is. What a mess. This is a big fish, I think. Yep, look, there it is down there, next to the motor. What's that? That other one getting popped? I'm here. There he is. Another horse. We gotta get a net. <laughs> oh crap, I'm about to run us into this island. Got him? Mm -hmm. I got to prevent us from running into this island. Oh boy, what a morning, what a morning. Yes, sir. Well, we're either at seven or eight over 20. We put that one back in the tank for a second so we can get these baits out. Because apparently there's just stripers everywhere. They everywhere today. No bait? No bait. No bait. Got us. Yep. Oh well. Fish, fish. I told you there'd be one right here. <laughs> no, it's you. I just caught the last one. All right. <laughs> I told you there'd be one. I was like, there's got to be a fish right here. There's got to be. Mm -hmm. Bonk. I think that's a good one. He didn't want the slow nope. bait. Though. We got that. Yeah, I threw the glide bait a couple times. He wanted the real thing. He wanted to get fed. All right, well, we're going to let this guy chill out for a second. Well, let's fight that one. This is our third double, over 20 pounds. That's the last bait we've got. Every single bait we had in the tank is gone, you guys. Every single one. They are all gone. He's hitting that main flow out there now. I'm trying to clear stuff, you guys. Man, that's the one that I broke. 
in like you guys have seen how many we've caught we've lost or just missed that many i mean this is this is one of the best more as a striper fishing i've ever had this is, this is beautiful we knew we were gonna have it it was all lining up wasn't it yep let me see what we got here beautiful we're about the only people out here other than the flag planer board guys that may be mad You're good. It'll just slide down. You can just reel past it. Keep that sucker bent, baby. Yes, sir. Yeah, it'll keep reeling. I believe you got a pretty good one, bro. Yeah, this is, this, he's definitely fighting harder than. I'm gonna rotate you around so he doesn't try to swim around us. So you got a better angle. Planer board's kind of being a butthole, but I don't want to. Okay. I'm going to get this out of your way back here. Good one? Oh, yeah. Another good one. Oh, that's a good one, bro. It's on the stinger hook rig again. What a good one, bro. That's a nice fish, bro. Come on, stay here, girl. Nope, 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 nope. Thick. Got her tail. Yeah, just keep that head up. Got her. That one's pushing 30. Get in here. There we go. Beauty. <laughs> yes, sir. Let's go. We're trying to take a picture of this fish, and there's stripers blowing up on bait right here. We got to go catch more bait. We're out. This is Jeff's monster that we just caught. Mine's still in the tank. Let's release that one. Get her back. 30 plus pound fish. Oh, she's gone. She gone? Yep. Yes, sir. Give me some knucks. Knuckles. Yeah. Boom. Got him. Here's mine. We lost two others. I'm totally out of bait with them. Skip Jack. We're up to how many fish now? Ten. Ten. Pretty much all over 20. One of them may have been like 17 to 18, but yeah. Good fish. See you later. Well, good morning. We are here with Seth. Seth is a hardcore cat fisherman. He's won a lot of tournaments and then meets the striper artificial world with Chris. And we're starting out live bait and we caught a bunch of big skipjack and we're in Seth's boat because mine's tiny and every time we try to do three people in my boat, it gets really hairy. But uh, we ain't even got baits out. Chris can't help himself and he's throwing a big 11 inch glide. <laughs> and then I'm gonna start getting planter boards and stuff out. So that's what we doing. Ideally, we'll catch a striper, but if we don't, we're going to have a good time anyways. But I think we'll run into one today. If anything, the weather in Thailand is beautiful this year. Is... We're in Vietnam today. Oh, are we in Vietnam? We're on the yeah. Nanking River. Nanking. No, the Saigon oh, River. It all blends together. Man. Yeah, I mean, it's just Vietnam. We played Fortunate Sun riding downstream. Flew over here overnight, 13 mile hours in the Delta Airlines layover in... Uh, Seoul, South Korea. One of those Charlies had a tracker boat. Yep. <laughs> and they had the big bait tank too. I mean, just like mine. <laughs> Send out our planer board here. We got a deep bank right here with current on it. And Chris is throwing his glide bait, checking to see if he can pull a really active fish out right off the bank. And then I'm going to come in with big live bait behind him. And Seth's reeling in the first fish because this is his boat. And he ain't never done the pull the live skipjack on planer boards thing. I'm hoping he gets to see some blow up. Get that guy out. 
I'm going to get another one. I'll go with a little bit of a smaller one on this guy. There's my wake up call when I'm not fishing. Nothing. That's too big. I'm gonna find one of the smaller ones. Yep. If they start blowing up, you can slow it down just a little bit to let them eat it, but this is good. Gosh, where's the smaller one at? Yeah, I'm gonna put two on. Yeah, I mean, we caught a couple out in the center too here. Single, single hooky boy. On the single hook rigs, guys, I always just use a smaller skip because they swim a whole lot harder or less controlled like with a single as opposed to the double in the nose. So they'll pull your board all over the place if you're not careful. And we're just tickling this timber here. Um, yeah, not yet. Let me get them out and then, then we'll go we from there. Fish on, fish on during the turn. Uh, it is, yeah, just real, 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 real. Get them. Fish on. Yep. There we go. Well, I guess they're over here today. Shoot, we gotta do it. Water change. Here's the first one. I'm in the middle of the water. Oh, oh, yeah, you gotta be, you gotta let them eat it longer than that, man. You gotta give them time to eat it. They're over here on this bank. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah, rotate this left. Fish in the boat. Pay off. Yep. <laughs> I told you. You just gotta find them. Okay. Just walking his pet striper. Yeah. I named him Bill. His name's Bill. How, how big's Bill? 16 pounds? Yeah, about 16. Well, we about had a double there. This one just didn't hook up. Chris screwed up. Chris's a Guggen at live bait. <laughs> That's okay. Look, man, he didn't have trouble hook hanging from it. We're, we're learning. I don't know what to do with it. It's not. Oh. <laughs> Gotta let him eat it a little bit. Sometimes they like to play with it. There, we're gonna get this guy back out and we're gonna take a picture of Jeff or what is it Bob Bill Bill Bill, Bill. Take a picture of Bill Well, there's, what was it, Bob? Bill, out, what did we decide on? I don't know. There's, the, there's the, our first fish. Yeah. <laughs> he just lil feller. He lil feller. He's a California strain. Got the broken lines on him. All righty. Little guy. We let him go. See you later, lil feller. Bye. Goodbye. That's number one. All right, Seth's turn now. I'm ready. Great. There's one. Hold you. There you go. Alright. <laughs> Here, I'll drive. I just told Seth was like, are we at a good distance here? And I'm like, yeah, we had an optimal distance. This is not turned on. How do you turn this on? Yeah, it is. It might be on. Uh, oh. oh shit, don't hit spot lock. I didn't hit spot lock. It just wasn't. There you go. Hit a Get that arrow up top left hand corner. That'll take it off of uh, north. Oh. Well, we're hooked up again. Let's get those two. Uh, yours is about to have a fish on it, Chris. I'm trying to learn how to use a motor guide. It's a little bit more touchy than my 
Minn Kota. How's he feel? How's he feel? I mean, he smacked the crap out of it. I was like, <laughs> Bonk. See if we can't get another double. I wonder those those just like out of the way. Yep. Hooked up. You guys gotta talk now. You gotta make this entertaining for people watching. We almost sank the boat. Way too much water got in the back. Yeah. That bilge front's been going for like four minutes. I figured out the yeah, yeah, definite. Uh, that was me. It's bigger than the one I caught. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. If you want to step over and grab those other two. Right? Knit them. Knit them. Knit them. Knit them. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. A little better fish? A lot better fish. Eh, not bad, not bad. Got him? Very nice, boys, very nice. Number two of the morning, there we go, that's 20 plus. Yeah. Not bad. That fish is probably 40 inches close to Yeah. It. That would be a short like, fish. Literally all of them yesterday were that size other than one. I require another bait and a rod. Give me the rod. That right there is called optimal distance. Mm -hmm. Optimal distance striper fishing. Oh, it's my turn, isn't it? Oh, this is a good one. Um, I, this this board got popped. If, Somebody will come back here and grab this one right next to me. We're almost like this bill just still running. Like so. Where you at? Um. Inside of it. Yeah. Or oh, yeah, I'm inside of it. Yeah. I'm, I think this is a fairly decent fish. That was a good one. Come on, baby, get on up here to daddy. Mark wants to catch his first fish of the day. There's some drag. Just sit in the hole now. Put him back out. Let's get a double. This one slammed it. Yes, sir. Get on up here. Get on up here, baby. Come on, baby girl. That sun's finally coming out and the stripers are starting to bite. Yep. <laughs> I'll walk him up there. Yeah, there's so much weight in the back of this boat, you guys, that water was coming over right here. So, we had to remedy that. That one just is getting chased right here. We may be about to have a double. I got a little drag there. Come on, buddy. Eat it. I have more drag. I haven't seen this fish yet. Yeah. I feel like the real big girls come up to the surface and go nuts at some point, though. I'm going to back the drag off just a little bit now that we're close. Huh? I thought he might get in the lawn if he's putting out Oh, he's actually about to. Oh, big blow up. Giant blow up. Wait for this one to go down right here. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Now it's on. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Real, 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 real. Don't thumb it, don't thumb it. You gotta let him go. Double, double. Well, we got a double on you guys. I need a net. I got you, I got you. Did he just come out? You're stuck on the, there we go. There's you. Is he stuck in a tree? Dang it. All right, well, we need to go on the other end of it. Is he on that tree way out there? All right, well, go go back to it. Well, he's snagged up on a tree, so we're going to try to get him out of it. 
I'll use your trolling motor to help you with it. Maybe standing up here for a few minutes. We may lose this fish, you guys. It's stuck. Yeah, he's got the, one of the trebles in the tree. Dang. Gone. Dang it. Rip. Do. That was a good one. Well, I got me getting boys. Yes, sir. And he got broken off, but we got to see the blow up and the drag peeling. That was, but that was worth it for me. Yeah. We about to see if this butthole's gonna try to eat our bait or not. Don't you do it! Don't you do it, butthole! He did it yesterday and ate it right off the hook. Didn't even get hooked. <laughs> like no joke. Right off the hook. <laughs> <laughs> this is getting nervous up here and guys we don't like this we don't like being here get me out of here trappers want to be right where the trash is at yeah come say hi got blow up right here wait for it wait for it real real hit him Set it. Real, real, real. Quick, 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 quick. All right, good. He about googified our live bait again. Oh, shut up. I was fine. <laughs> <laughs> I, had, I had planned the whole time. Still working on Yeah, it's letting go. It's deep out here. Maybe. Well. Well, we're hooked up again. Trying to get all our baits out. We still got another striper in the tank that we're trying to release. If it's snagged, it's snagged. Don't worry about it. Yeah, just just focus on the fish. Don't worry about this one. Yeah, he's on it. It don't matter. How's it feel? It feels good. It feels like I haven't caught one of these in forever because I haven't. Fish is heavy. I mean, it's pretty big at Jake's. Yeah. I'd be a little light on the drag compared to what you usually do. I think you can pull. Yep, that's why it's pulled. Yeah, you can't do that on my face points. Reel down, reel. Yep. You got him? Yeah. Small fish, I think. I'll let me grab that. Hey, you're going slack. I know. I was trying to get this turn back to the yeah, that's a little good. Well, that was unfortunate, Chris. Yeah, Big head. We got a little, little feller. We gotta get you a lanyard, bro. That's gonna end up going in the water. Yeah, it's broke. Oh. It's I'll, I'll make you a 100 pound lanyard. That's what I use. I seen you. Why is this not? Yeah, it's like a thousand. Little guy, little guy. This is the eating size right here. We just spit on our skipjack. Hi, Steve. I see little boy. Come here. There we go. What is that? Four or five? Uh, very nice, very nice. Strap in the boat. Strap in the tank. You chilling, bud? Yeah, he chilling. Couple good ones there. Lost a really good one. Are we gonna release him? See you later. She gone. I'm gonna release this one. This one's been, this, this one's been out for a little bit. We're still gonna sit here for a second. Big chilling. We gotta get our boat turned back around. How many stripers are we at? Six? Yeah. Yep, six. six. Got broken off by one. Lost one good one. Not bad. We'll see if we got any more bait left. And that's it. Came off. Didn't even grab that in a hurry, did he? Yep. Damn. What the hell? That was a bonk-a-lonk. <laughs> I might come out with it. 
Uh oh, slow down, slow down. I saw that coming up. That was a blow up. He's, still He's on, on it. it. Oh, buddy. Give it some wine. Hold it and wait. Yep, you gotta let him eat it. He's on it. He's still on still it. Still on it, I felt him. I felt it to the rod, yeah. We called it right next to that tree. Yeah. <laughs> you want to try to pull away from him a little bit? Uh, just, we don't have a choice now. I mean, he's on it or not. And we're either going in the he's tree on it, he's or on not. It. He's on it. Hit him. All right, so reel down, reel down. Reel, reel, reel. You got to reel. You got him? That's that big bait. Yeah, he's on. Very nice. Epic. I can feel him through the rod. Yep. Got him. Let me get this skipjack pull out of the way. We're running out of bait. Like our bait tank's empty and oh, all the log. Back up. Back up. Put it in the preschool. No, you don't. No, we got. You feel him He's still on him. He's still on. Yeah, Put it in preschool. I'm in preschool. I'm taking off. He's taking off. He's under the log. What do you all want to do? He's still on it. Um, I'm gonna get these. I'm gonna pull back. See if I can get enough number. Come on. If he's under it or over it. Yeah, we can go back. He's definitely still there. Okay. Well, we've got another one in a tree. Uh, what are we doing here? Dumb shit. We got a big striper down there that's stuck. And uh, he's going to go get it. Cool. Make sure your phone's out of your pocket, keys, everything. Yeah, I'm taking my keys over here. I'm going to hit the spot up. Yep. Let me back away from it just a little bit. Remember, I got baits all in the water down there. Up that way. You ready to do it? No, that water's going to be cold. Just like your people, you can swim. They will go under. You made the joke earlier. Yeah, get that rod. Get that rod. Ooh, it's cold. The best thing to do is just jump straight in. Yeah, I know, but it's cold. I'll use the line to guide me down. Yep. <laughs> Watch out for the treble hook. That's that, a single hook. That one. A single hook? Okay. Yeah. He's going down. Not happening. No, it's way down there. I didn't even get to the bottom. Maybe grab the rod. You can stick my rod in the water. I don't care. All right. So, shit. You have to hold on to me. I'm going to float off. Whew. I'm going to get a little bit too here, on top hold, of hold this. <laughs> we didn't get the striper, <laughs> but he tried. Whew. Now we got to mess with Skipjack. They're all half dead. They look, they've all been hit and messed up. That was cold. <laughs> Deep too. It's like a single log. Right there. Reel down one more time. Yep. Yep. Or I see the skipjack. That's the skippy. We got that fish. We pulled the log up. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> oh my gosh. Get you kicked off YouTube if I make a wetback joke. Oh my gosh. <laughs> but you can make it. I can't. Oh. Well, here's this fish you went swimming for. Yeah. I'm gonna do it like this. I want to make it look gigantic for all that. Like <laughs> Let's take a picture with him. <laughs> Alright, you gonna keep him or release him? I'll release him. He deserves yeah, the lift. He, he deserves it. He's probably traumatized more than I am. He's like, why is this guy swimming down here together? <laughs> like, I'm just gonna hide under this lock. Very nice. I'll let him revive for a minute. Oh, Seth and I were getting hangry at each other there. <laughs> Shut up. No, hold on. <laughs> don't grab the pole he's not going to remember to grab the pole not to grab the pole because he's in the water dying trying to get this fish <laughs> oh. yeah it's like that was an unintentional swim how cold is it 58 yeah, I... freezing balls it's what it said on the uh the, the depth finder freezing balls yeah it's just, <laughs> a, it's just the logo of some like nuts with ice on them <laughs> I'm like, yeah i'll jump in <laughs> I don't remember that in the hypothermia class. They just said cold. It may be retying. That's fine. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah, I'm gonna go take a nap. Well, Chris was gonna eat this guy, but Seth talked him out of it. I was gonna eat him just out of spite. Like I haven't kept the striper in over over a decade, and this one. This one about got it. This one about got it. Yeah. He's good. Nice job, sir. Knuckles. We'll go dry it off, running back up to get bait. Yeah. Seth and I didn't kill each other, but it was close. It wasn't even close. <laughs> the guy would have probably been the one to die. Yeah. Well, you dried off now? Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah, I'm tired now. Yeah, I'm getting tired. What about you? Big adrenaline rush and now it's warm. I'm here. I'm good. I'm hungry. I think that's the biggest thing for me. I'm ready to catch a fish. It's my turn. We had the most dope video of this thing eating and everything, but I'm pretty sure the GoPro file corrupted, but here's an 18 pounder. Not bad, not bad. I have no idea if you're gonna get to watch the fight and the eat and everything on it, but is what it is. We gonna let her go. See ya. What is that, number nine? Seven, I don't even know. Eight. Eight. I was wrong on both counts. But <laughs> either way, I'm starving. It's nine degrees again today. 